Members of the Defence Force and Protective Services participated in the 2023 Urban Search and Rescue USAR training program. The week-long intensive training program ended with a disaster simulation. Lead instructor at World Hope International Larry Mullins shared a course overview. He said while those who participated were taught some valuable skills, he said experience will assist in honing these skills. The best tool that you can take to any disaster response is your ability to improvise and think, not depend on any one tool or piece of equipment. Your ability to make do with what you have is going to be the one thing that's going to get you through any disaster response. You exhibited that continuously throughout the week. I'm very fortunate back home where I have lots of resources available to me. You guys pulled off the same quality of training with much less. CEO of the Office of Disaster Preparedness and Management, ODPM, Major General Rodney Smart, said to be successful in the field of disaster preparedness, an individual must be dedicated and determined. For us at the ODPM, the completion of this course is a triumph for which we are eternally grateful. The training follows an urban disaster resiliency and preparedness pilot study conducted of Port of Spain titled Prepare TT. He said based on the results of the study, the ODPM saw it fitting to access this level of training. Permanent Secretary in the Ministry of National Security, Nataki Atiba Dilchan, said the course has equipped the graduates with the technical knowledge and skills necessary to effectively and efficiently respond to severe hazards such as earthquakes, tsunamis and landslides. You are now able to conduct rapid assessments, search for and rescue survivors, provide medical assistance, and manage disaster scenes safely. In essence, you have been empowered to be the heroes, and I think we have a heroine, <laughs> who we can turn to, particularly people like me, when disasters strike. The ODPM believes that the USAR training is a vital asset for disaster preparedness and effective response. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TTT News.